In 2006, the biggest dethroning in our solar system took place. The hero? Pluto. How could a spherical body orbiting the sun and with a giant moon like Charon lose its planetary status? The answer lies in three criteria established by the International Astronomical Union in 2006. For an object to be classified as a planet, it must meet the following three conditions. First, it orbits the sun. Second, it has sufficient gravity to be spherical. Pluto met both. So what was the problem? The problem lay in the third condition, the condition of gravitational dominance, clearing its orbit of other objects. Pluto wasn't large or powerful enough. It resided within a very crowded region called the Kuiper Belt. Because it shared its orbit with thousands of icy bodies, Pluto couldn't achieve gravitational dominance by clearing, ejecting, or incorporating other small objects into its orbit, so it was reclassified as a dwarf planet. Pluto is a spherical body orbiting the Sun, but it didn't dominate its surroundings. This is the tragedy of Pluto, the undisputed king of dwarf planets. But are there other dwarf planets in the solar system? We'll find out in the following video.